Well, the last video I, video I posted on YouTube was me standing in minus 16 degree weather in St. Paul, Minnesota. I've changed venues here, as you can see from the uh, palm trees here. I'm down at where uh, the Minnesota Twins have their spring training camp. It's not spring training yet, but it is fantasy baseball camp. And if you're not familiar with fantasy baseball camp, well, here is what it is. All these guys dressed here in white are, uh, in fact, let me just turn the camera around so I can see what you're seeing. I think I can do that. Um, how do I do that? I thought I could turn it around. Apparently I can't. Okay. All these guys dressed in white are, uh, are you know, just regular guys who love baseball. And they pay about $5,000 each, and women are invited, as you can see right here. They pay about $5,000 each to come down here for one week in January and play baseball. And the guys in the red shirts, there's one there, uh, out on the field. The guys in red shirts are former pro players for the Twins. So they get to hang around with some of their idols. They divide up in teams. They play for championships. They have dinners. They all have breakfast together. It costs about $5,000 a week. And uh, they get the, you know, it's called fantasy baseball for a reason. Um, I'd like to introduce you to uh, Bill Clavitz. Bill Clavitz works here. Bill, I'm sorry, I, I tried to turn this camera around, but I can't. So, okay. Um, well, what do you What do you do here? What is your Well, job? actually, I'm a camper here. I, I don't. Well, I work on the baseball field. I've been here. This is my ninth year at camp, and to be honest, this is so much fun. It should be illegal. And how many people are? How many guys participate in this this week? Well, normally it's about 120 to 140 guys. Wow. We usually have you know somewhere between eight and 12 teams. And I know they say in generally saying the same, but no, you can bring spouses and children. In fact, some of some of these teams playing right here on these various fields have actually, their wives. This is my son Jeff right here. He's getting up to the bat. Hi, Jeff. So we actually, Hi. We have father son things going on here. There's a lot of father sons, father daughters. Um, Dick Lining Kugel's here with his two daughters and son. It's a great family event. And as I mentioned to you before I started rolling this, that I, I'm not from Minnesota, so I don't know many of the players. Yeah. I don't follow baseball closely. Who are some of the players who are here that, that folks who follow baseball, would, whose names they'd recognize? Well, most notably, Tony Oliva, the I've newest entry to the Hall of Fame, Burt Blylevin, another uh, Hall of Famer, Kent Herbeck, Tim Laudner, um, we got J.C. Romero, Tommy Watkins. I, Tommy Watkins is now the third base coach. Um, and there's just guys from all over the place. Uh, and they hang out with the regular guys, guys. Right? right? They are regular guys. Everybody here is a regular guy, regardless if you played 30 years in the pros or you're just here for the week. It's great. All right. Well, it's a great way to spend a week in Florida when it's uh, cold in Minnesota. Well, I heard rumor it's only 19 below up there right now, so <laughs> not a big deal. <laughs> it is snowing today. Yeah. Um, hey, thanks very much, Bill. Appreciate it. Oh, my pleasure. So, twins. <laughs> so yeah, if you're a Twins fan, now listen, your team has, your team in all likelihood has one of these fantasy uh, league things happening every uh, at January or maybe February, I don't know, uh, as well. So if you're a Yankees fan or uh, some other baseball fan, uh, just go online and look for, you know, Yankees uh, fantasy baseball team. Or, well, in fact, down the road at JetBlue this is, Stadium. This is Bill's brother. Yes, in fact, down the road at JetBlue Stadium. Here? Yes, the Red Sox are doing their fantasy camp next week. Well, I should, I should, uh, you know, I didn't tell you. I'm in, I'm, I'm in Naples, Florida, and uh, that's where this camp is being held. I'm sorry, I should have mentioned that in the, in the uh, western part of Florida on the other coast. Um, and I didn't know. This. So the Jets are here as, as well. Yeah, Jet Jets. Blue Stadium, Jet, yeah, yeah, with the oh Boston Red Sox. Oh, Jet Blue, the airline yes, stadium with the Boston Red Sox. Everybody has a sponsor. In fact. Before the episode's over, we're going to be selling sponsorships on Rudy's forehead. So this this may be uh, the my pillow forehead before the day is out. Uh, my pillow, uh, uh, Mike Lindell is from Minnesota. That's a sort of Minnesota joke. At any rate, this very sort of yeah, very sort of. Um, so here it is, fantasy camp. If you are a baseball fan, if you're a man, a woman, a child. Uh, uh, go online and look for your team and, and look up Fantasy Camp and see what's going on. Uh, they'll be obviously be in warm climes in January. They're not, you know, not going to be happening in Minnesota. Um, so from the Twins uh, Spring Training Camp in... Um, in uh, Fort Myers. In, Beautiful. In, Fort are, are we Myers. actually in, technically in Fort Myers? No, technically, yes, we are. Okay. I'm, technically, we are. I'm staying we, with my friend and Chuck. And you've noticed how much colder it is this far north. <laughs> I'm staying about a half an hour away in... Uh, in uh, we're Naples, Florida, uh, with Chuck, who's, who uh, has rented a condominium here. At any rate, um, a lot better being here than uh, that last posting in the 16-degree 
minus 16 degrees St. Paul uh, uh, weather. Anyway, uh, fa Fantasy Baseball Camp, you may have heard about it. If you haven't, uh, it's a lot of fun. Look it up online for your favorite baseball team, and you can come down and hang with some of the legends and uh, play a lot of baseball. They give you your uniforms with your names on it, you know. I mean, it's it's uh, they, they do it upright. All right, take care. Bye-bye.